Welcome back to Heath Rouse Barbecue. Today we're keeping it simple. We're doing honey pecan salmon on the Traeger 885 with pecan pellets. Me and my wife love this recipe, so let's get started. First thing that we want to do to our salmon once we get it out of the pack and get it semi-dried off, this is a skin-on center cut piece of salmon. Now the only thing that I'm going to do to it is take a little bit of olive oil and now you want to run your hand over this, make sure you wash your hand and you want to feel and make sure there's no bones left in your salmon. Especially down on the belly part, you want to make sure everything's pulled out and you can get it out pretty easy, it's not a big deal. But once you've got some olive oil rubbed in, I've got this on some parchment paper here, some butcher paper, actually. You can use parchment paper, anything like that. It's just easy to move it on and off the grill, really easy. I'm gonna take some pecan rub. Now, pecan rub is my wife's favorite way to eat grilled salmon. We have this meal at least once every week to two weeks at least. We love salmon. Make sure you season all your sides. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Get around the edges there. Now, I'm not just gonna cake it up on here, but we do like this pecan rub. A good little hint. Now, I'm gonna come back with a little bit of honey rub on top of that and sprinkle it on. Now, what this honey rub is gonna do is give it a nice golden color. And the taste with the pecan rub is gonna be incredible. So if you want the absolute greatest flavor combined on fish, honey pecan, is the only way to go. Only way to go. Once this reaches about 115 to 120 degrees, and that should take anywhere from 25 to 30 minutes with a center cut piece of fish like this, uh, with it not being a full slab, it may only take about 15 is when I'm gonna start checking it. You wanna get it to about 120 degrees, and then we're gonna glaze it with some spicy honey and let it finish off about 125, and we're gonna be ready to eat. So let's get it over here on the Traeger and get it started. 275 degrees with pecan pellets. After it reached our 117, 118 degrees in our thermo pen, I went ahead and glazed it. I use Mike's Hot Honey here. Really simple, really easy. It's a great honey. You can find it on Amazon or everywhere else. It's great on this salmon. Our center cut filet of salmon is off the grill. So just to recap, we started with a two pound center cut salmon filet. We then checked it for bones, rubbed it down with a little bit of olive oil. We seasoned it with a good medium coat of our pecan rub and our honey rub. The savory and sweet note works perfect on grilled salmon. Salmon is so easy to cook. We placed it on this butcher paper here where we could remove it on and off the grill without tearing it. This is also skin on salmon. Skinless would be fine too. It's completely up to you. Once we put it on, we let it go for about 30 minutes. We checked the temp, we were around 117 degrees, so 118. I went ahead and glazed it with a Mike's Hard Honey, left it on for another eight to 10 minutes. It come on up to temp to 125. I pulled it off, let it rest for about 10 minutes, and now it's the moment of truth to get in here and try it. So let's try this fish. The savory, sweet, spicy note on this fish is incredible. I will tell you, all of our rubs are interchangeable on this fish. If you want a little more of a kick, be sure to use our honey chipotle instead of our honey rub. But the pecan rub on salmon is mine and my wife's favorites. I'm sure to be yours too once you try. If you like what we're doing on our channel, be sure to like, subscribe, follow along, and share it with your friends. You can find us on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, and of course, YouTube. I'll see you next week with another recipe.